And welcome back to The Long Run, where we are playing Kirby in the Forgotten Land. Uh, so we're doing some pretty good progress on uh, clearing everything out here. Uh, we did miss a few at uh, Alival Mall here, unfortunately. That's even after two passes of the stage. Um, we managed to clear out of our Bay Coast and the first stage of Wondaria. So now we have our work cut out for us because we still have a whole bunch of things to do here. But uh, we have increased our population by 16 so far in this stream. So let's go back to Waldy Town, see if anything new has happened. Probably not. But also, um, well, Elphalin here is uh, talking about present codes. There probably are still some present codes hidden in town, but there is a present code hidden in the Nintendo News Bulletin that expires today. So if you have a copy of the game, go grab your, uh, your Switch right now. Uh, hang on. And go put in the word 30th. I mean the, the code's been there for a little while. I might have been I might have even been able to get it um last stream. But um, I neglected to check. The so one Carmouth cake and one rare stone. Yeah, making the codes expire is kind of lame. This is go ahead and get it. You don't even have a TV that supports this. You don't need a TV, Jewel. Um, that's a nice thing with a Switch. If you don't have a TV that supports it, just play it in handheld mode. Alright, Circuit Speedway. I had that fear missing out, exactly. Reach the first race's goal within 20 seconds, and there's also one hidden Waddle Dee. Which is the last one. It's all right, I got the express pass. Yeah, we already missed it. Uh, actually, does it give us a, a retry star? Yeah, it does give us a retry star, so we can just use that instead of... Uh, uh, there we go. Instead of exiting the stage, we can just retry here. You probably actually want to avoid hitting as much as possible, actually. Yeah. That was 22.
I'm so hungry I could eat a car. Kirby, who can't this time for some reason. I always wanted a hot rod. Hmm. Still a lot of hitting things here. That was better, but it's still not good enough. Gotta get that sub 20. Seems like you don't lose as much speed if you're jumping while you hit something. Now oh, that's still not good enough. Unless there's like a shortcut that I'm missing, which I don't think I am. Jump over the red and white wheels, make the darn sharper. Like these, yeah. Actually. I thought I thought I had uh, knocked over a pile there, but I guess not. Okay, well, it's definitely not going to be this try. Still got the sub 25. But yeah, that's probably the strat here is just take the turns as sharply as possible. Ah. Especially that one, I think, where the most amount of time can be saved. See, I still got 22 seconds despite uh, hitting a wall there. And I think it's because I did not I didn't manage to make that jump. All right, this is the one, guys. Yeah, 
Yeah, that was absolutely it. 18.3 seconds. Ah. We're done with that. Oh, what's the, uh, okay, fourth Waddle Dee. <laughs> First try. I mean, as far as the game as far as the game's concerned, it basically is the first try because the game does reset your uh, your stats to like just before you actually started the event when you use the retry star. That's going to be where the second one is. I'm guessing, I think there are like three um, racing parts. I think it might have been like the third one. I didn't get it. Now. There we There's the third one. And here's where the fourth one is. Got to clear the track in 50 seconds this time. I was about to say 30 for some reason. Oh yeah, I saw that uh I saw that shortcut that I missed there. Fifty four seconds. All right, that wasn't too bad. We can definitely get fifty. That's not going to be a problem. But first of all, let's turn directly off to the right here. There we go. Landed that jump this time. That's how you do. Okay. 
Ow. That probably cost us the friggin' race. Ooh! Point one eight seconds. Point oh one eight seconds. That could not have been any closer. That's awesome. Like a boss. Warp star. Ice Kirby. And Elf. Ah, Elfalin. I knew a hiccup was coming, I just. It always seems to happen while I'm speaking. Hammer treasure, bomb treasure. Invasion at the House of Horrors. One hidden model D to find. Get ready for jump scares, guys. Oh man, that was scary. Okay, that actually hurt. Ah. So we've run into at least one. Oh, it's getting dark and spooky. Oh man, game is praising us for doing the thing that we already knew to do. Dang. Ah. I want that capsule. No. There we go. That might be a level two capsule. It's hard to tell in this darkness. Oh. Uh. Hi.
this is probably going to be the third one. There we go. Ah, I got it wrong. Whatever. It clearly said on the box that it was not a um it was not a D, so not worried. Oh, that's the third one. Actually, I probably needed that fire, didn't I? Will it come back? Oh, it's this place. Okay. Hmm. Starting to wonder if this is one that, like, I did run across, but I missed. Well, Cake. Hundred and fifty shots. Hope I didn't like already miss it. There it was. There we go. And there we go, another stage clear. That's Kirby. Wanna posters. 
storage mouth Kirby. There's an achievement in Bit Trip Runner for getting intentionally hit if you miss gold. Hundred percent sure everyone got it by accident. Like, well, so sorry that you didn't that you didn't get your gold, but uh, hey, at least you won something. The Wendaria Dream Parade, one hidden D, and it's the first one. Uh, and Elflin's a wanted poster. What? What did I even swallow? What did I, did I swallow like the flame? I do need to be on high alert here because if I if I see a Waddle D cage without a Waddle D in it, I know that I've gone too far. Hmm. Thing over there? No. I wonder. I was wondering maybe like it's on top of one of those uh one of those parade vehicles, but no. Come on. There we go. Ah. I keep jumping over my shots. Dang. Thank you. Probably already missed it too. Splat. Oh, how did I miss you? You were right there.
Okay, so now we're looking for a wanted poster of Alpha Lynn. on the wall before the door. Uh. Well, at least now we know where things are. So we can just rush through. Curry, please. At least Tornado makes it easy to skip things. Well, so much for Tornado. Okay, so on the wall before the door. Is it is it here that you're talking about, Jewel? Because here would make sense. Ah. Well. If it is there, I don't see it. That's okay, Jewel. Like the the important thing is to actually like be sure we didn't miss it. Because this is probably like in a fairly obvious place if you're actually looking for it and the more obvious something is to like yeah, the more obvious something is the longer it's going to take me to find it. <laughs> Under three seconds. 
And it could be around here, which is why I came here in the first place. This is one area that technically is a HAL room. Wait, how is this at, like, this room here, or the room where... Um... The poster is. Not sure how this is a hell room. Oh, if you finish the race with a ridiculously long time. Eighty something. Hey Google, when was Hal Laboratory founded? Nineteen eighty. Let's try just eighty seconds. And you you have to be trying to not get the uh the time for this. I'm just going to sit here for uh, another uh, half a minute and uh, see what happens. Elflin hanging out on the hood of our car. Six, seven, eight, nine, eighty. Uh, well, that didn't do anything. It's probably like either more than eighty or less than eighty or eighty exactly. Eighty six. All right. Does it need to be like exactly 86 or can it be more than 86? Eighty-six. I assume that means like between 86 and 87 seconds. But yeah, let's uh let's see. Hey Google. When did Kirby's Dreamland come out? Kirby's Dreamland. 1992. So that's not a year. What happened in 86?
Hey, Google. When did Eggerland come out? That's absolutely not what I asked. As soon as she said 1845, I was like, what? No, I thank you. But yeah, Eggerland is the first Adventures of Lolo game. There it is. Yeah, if it's not something to do with um with Kirby, it probably is something to do with Adventures of Lolo. Oh geez. Well, we missed that one. Um, remove Elflin's wanted poster, right? There it is. Got it. So now we just have to finish the stage. Eggerland was released in Pinball was 1984. That was also how. Not that we need these coins, but gamers' prerogative. Ah. Uh, no. Thank you. And there we go.
I seem to recall that yes, Hal did make Kabuki Quantum Fighter. They they made a collection of games. Like the their gameography leading up to Kirby is um colorful. I think they also made Air Fortress. All right, hit high up Clarlin using Ranger. The SNES port? That one I wasn't aware of. And that makes me very happy, honestly. Well, that's uh, that's without getting hit gone. And I think without getting hit is gonna be hard, honestly. So now I have to hit Clarlin while she's up there. There we go. Well, I got hit there, but that's fine. The thick cat, yes. Dang. I just realized I'm almost dead. That didn't help. Oh my goodness. That should do it. Right? No, just barely not. There we go. So now we have to do that without taking a hit. We also have to do that um, probably within a given amount of time. And without hovering. Oh, mama. Okay. Go back to Waddle Dee Town. Go take a nap. Snooze. Since we have so much money, I'm just going to buy a life up. Oh, you've been such a loyal customer. I want to thank you, so I got you this special figure.
first new figure of the of the session. Item Shop Waddle D. This enterprising Waddle D opened his own item shop in town. He sells special items that will help you out. He also supplies the cafe with an energy drink he makes uh, that he makes by hand. They have a special biz business arrangement: two energy drinks for three Kirby burgers. I'm guessing you didn't find that one, Tyrion. So I gotta do this without getting hit within a, an amount of time that I don't know yet. And without hovering. That's the last one you're missing? Well, I'm glad I was able to help. Out. Oh, that's without getting hit, gone. Oh, uh, yeah, I misread that, sorry. Okay, so that's without hovering done. Within a minute thirty. What would be the best ability for that? Now give it one more go.
I'm surprised I didn't get hit there. Oh, that's without getting hit, gone. But maybe I can get the time trial. Let's shoot her down. There we go. I only got hit the once. So that's not too bad. Yep, that's the time trial done. Actually, now that I think about it, I'm pretty sure that is the one dance. Okay, last try. If I don't get without getting hit this time, then... That's just too bad. I'm going to use the bombs for this. Just so I can keep away and just pelt her continuously. And that I don't get distracted while she's... uh. She's up on the, uh, oh, hydrate. I'll do that before fighting the boss. Thank you. There we go. Feel like I'm getting a lot of close calls here. Well, Oh boy. Oh, that was, uh, that was too close. There we go. 
Ooh. And that's without getting hit. Want to see that same dance again? There it is. And that's the last one in Wonderia. I'm not going to stay here for too long. Well, not any longer than we have to. Destroy four animal snow sculptures and reach the clock tower. Four animal snow sculptures and reach the clock tower. Well, there's one there. That's probably not the one they're talking about, though. Well, there's one. I'll just let you chill there. Isn't this the one that has like three cans in it? No, that's later in the game. See, the, the way that I think about it is, like, it doesn't really look at, but Kirby is getting older. And just ages slowly, because that's what his species does. But the more he ages, um, the less diversity he has. So... Before, when he did the Kirby dance, he split into three. He no longer does that. Before, he had all different types of dances. He no longer really does that. Um, and when you consider that Meta Knight is 
of that same species Um, I feel like Meta Knight probably started off about the same as Kirby. But eventually, like, he, um... He lost his copy ability. And the last ability that he had copied became permanent which is the sword ability. So he ended up with only sword ability, but really good at it. And eventually Kirby will be stuck with one ability as well, whether we'll ever, you know, see the game where that happens. Probably not. Oh, we need the uh... I mean, it could also be that Meta Knight still has his copy ability and refuses to use it. Can't wait for Kirby to be stuck with sleep. I will say this about... Uh, about the ranger ability, like, the more it's charged, um, the faster the reticle moves. So when it's fully charged, it is hard to aim. Can't wait for Kirby to be stuck with sleep. Yep. There's another snow sculpture, but uh, I'm still only up to two, which worries me a little bit. I see a platform over there. Uh, just for a capsule. Which still have yet to uh to get a unique capsule. Uh, within the context of, like, stages today. Nice. Level two capsule. And that one actually might be a uh, a unique one. Oh, 
No, of course that didn't work. Yeah, there's the there's the golden cage. I'm pretty sure that we did miss one somewhere. And by one I mean the snow sculpture. Well, there's the clock tower. Ah, I see. Secret spot here, a red star here, and yeah, we did miss uh, one of the snow sculptures. It's probably like one in each uh, room or something. I want to try to get to uh, the boss of this area. So I think I'm just not going to worry about it and just move on. Ooh. Balloon Meister. Balloon Meister loves to do tricks. No one, uh, no, one know, no one knows where to learn them. Perhaps it's hereditary? Whatever it is, the tricks are fun. Just don't let the ball touch you. Try to, in try to, in try to inhale it again. Uh, Try to inhale it instead to get the bomb ability. There we go. Hey, wait, where did it get that ball? I I are good at words. Wolf. No information on Wolf because that's uh that's an enemy that came with us from Dreamland. Metro on ice, find two secret passages. Uh, is it death water? Yeah, it sure is. Okay. But be on the lookout for hidden passages. Uh, 
Actually, Yeah. Capsule. Well, that didn't work out. Hang out there. Come to think of it, maybe I do need hammer for this. Well, if I didn't think before that I needed a hammer. Uh, that is not a secret passage. That's just a hidden compartment. Wow. A perfectly timed there to not uh to not hit the guy. Or a level two capsule. And there's one hidden passage. Actually, let's let's take it and just in case that the second one might be down here too. I don't know. Probably isn't. Ow. Okay. The second one wasn't there, which 
I didn't figure it was, but. Ah. Really? You weren't dead? Interesting. Well, level one capsule. Now, where is the passage that I missed? Dang. directly into the death water. I'm probably not going to be able to get over to that side with the uh with the cone, huh? Nope, completely missed the uh the other passage. Not even a clue of where it was. So that one's just going to continue to elude me. Like I like I said, I do want to try to get to the boss of this area before the end of the stream here. Drill. Burrow underground with your mighty drill. You can use this to dodge enemy attacks. If you dig into certain spots, you might be able to sneak into off-limits areas. <laughs> Robert. Or as he is called in uh, the first game, Bront Bert. Kirby breaking the law, oh man. Um also let me see. Yeah, I got all of the uh the treasure roads. Metro nice. Windy freezing seas. Find a cave that's safe from the wind. 
Find a cave that's safe from the wind. And that is the first one. It's probably just going to require some uh, experimentation here, honestly. Don't think this qualifies as a cave. Ow. Bye. Well, if it's safe from the wind, it's probably the the wind's probably not coming into it. No, oh, that's definitely the way forward, isn't it? Well, <coughs> excuse me. It looked like there was a little spot. A cave to the left of what, Jewel? Dang. Ah! So far, I'm just finding death. I'm not sure left of where you broke the ice with the pipe thing. Oh yeah. And that's why I, okay. That's why I needed a needle to get the boost that I needed to actually get in there. Yes, Jewel, you are smart. That is why you should stop saying you're dumb.
Now, ju just because you make an error doesn't mean you're dumb. Is this here? Probably need fire for that. There's fire up there, but I'm not gonna worry about it. That's probably um probably something that uh like a hidden model D or something that I don't need to find again. Yeah, I got everything, so. Dang. Capsule right there. And there we go. It's a new best. Big Kaboo. And, uh, oh, Bomber. Okay. See, I always call it Crash Bomb. All the Waldies saved. Oh. Speed and swerve, conveyor circuit. All right. Didn't we already do a car mouth? Or are there just two of them? Didn't jump. <laughs> Jumped when I shouldn't have. Just plain missed the conveyor belt there. Well... There we go. This feels like Sky Roads, which is not necessarily a good thing, but we got it. Oh. 
Okay, next stage. Oh. I guess I was missing some. I didn't think I was. Uh, the Battle of Blizzard Bridge. Missing six, including one that we don't know. So missing, what was it, the first, second, and fifth? Yeah, first, second, and fifth Waldies, four wanted posters, and beat Twin Wild Frosty without getting hit. Uh, I think it's 1,500 monies. Oh, hey. You know how I was saying that this mechanic is basically not used throughout the entire game? Okay, Florina. Dang. Wham. Well, all right. There we go. Okay. Yeah, trying to practice not getting hit right now. There we go. 
And I have this one, so I'm not going to worry about doing this. There's number four down there. And here is where I need to not get hit. And I immediately get hit because of course I do. At this point, I'm just getting hit all over the place because I don't care. Can you please stop that? Yeah, I can see hitting this one challenge in particular because... Like, you get to the end of the stage, and then you have to uh, kill these two jerks without taking a hit. And if you do take a hit, well, too bad for you. Gotta do the entire stage again. That was clearly not what to do. Oh, okay. There we go. We also haven't been looking for the wanted posters because I completely forgot that was a thing. Come to think of it, I think they're probably all in the side areas, aren't they? Oh, went right by it. Take a detour and find a Maxim tomato. Interesting. Cappy. Gearing. Well, that's three more bottle Ds, at the very least. Now let's go fight King DDD. Swallow King DDD's hammer is the one that I did do. Clear without guarding already did. Uh, and then there's a time trial, at, tri time trial, and then not getting hit. You love that one challenge because it's dumb. We will be coming back to it, but probably not today, because we're pretty much out of time here. Um, also, since I haven't done so today, and I forgot to get another energy drink oh did i not hold it to the thing long enough there we go hmm no, actually no 
Yeah, I'll just hang out here. Well, there goes not getting hit. At least I got that. Yangi. Bit of a trade of blows at the end there, but uh, we got there. And we did get the time trial at minute 30. And clear without taking any damage. So for that, I think I'm going to go back to town and um, get bomb. Because that's how I tend to do this. For the most part, it has worked out for me. And since we're here... Just because I can. Uh, there we go. So which one are we going to upgrade? The hammer or the sword? I haven't had I haven't taken the opportunity to use the actual uh twitch pull feature yet, so let's do that. Julmara says sword, but has she picked sword in the poll? She says she has, so let's see how that's going to turn out. Sword with three votes. All right. And then we shall proceed to not use it right away. Because I do want to use bomb for um for the more the the d for the DDD fight, but there is the Morpho Knight Sword. Hammer is good if you dodge. Sword is better regardless if you dodge or not. 
Well, you know my play style. Dodging, what's that? This has some huge knockback. There we go. Did we restore health out of that? Ah, all right. Uh, so yeah. The third hit of a combo heals a bit. Interesting. Yeah, the thing did say I unlocked a thing as well. Uh, it's... I unlocked a, uh, a treasure rift. Over there. Uh, hang on. Okay, clear without taking any damage. And I grab that even though we shouldn't need it. Also, I'm going to assume that Taking any damage also includes these two guys. So far, so good. Ah! And there we go. 
Homing bomb comes in clutch again. Homing bomb, best bomb. Whew, that was intense. Yeah, I I would I would agree with that, Tyrion. So we started with two hundred and thirty Waddle Ds. We are up to two hundred and sixty-three. So we found thirty-three today, which is not bad. But uh, unfortunately, we've lost our pace of. Um, We we've lost our pace of getting like about twenty percent progress every day. Let's go ahead and do a few gotcha cranks, I guess. We'll go we'll go through each one until we get a duplicate. No bottle. There's our duplicate. Blueprint. These precious paper plans will show you how to upgrade your copy abilities. Kirby can't do much with them on his own, but the Waddle Dee in the weapon shop can use them to dink donk bonk every ability to be even more powerful. What a skilled what a skilled engineer. Vending machine. No carton. Kirby is not a certified professional. And there's our duplicate. Strong Arm Delusion Phantom Goramondo. This illusory beast was created with powerful psychic energy in a realm of dreams. It's not the real Goramondo, just a phantom made of negative thoughts, but it's still incredibly strong. Since it's based on memories of the real Goramondo, it can't resist a fruity snack. Storm Tornado, ominous clouds, powerful winds. This scary storm roars to life with the press of a button. Put, uh, pull enemies into your cyclone by swirling into them, then attack with lightning. Mint-flavored Goromondo, yes indeed. His illusory nemesis, Phantom King DDD. This DD devil... Oh, liberty taken there is made of powerful psychic energy. It's an illusion of the king based on memories of his embarrassing turn under IDF-86's control, forced to work for Leongar and capture Elphalan. It has no memory of Kirby or the adventures they've shared. It's little more than a haughty, hollow husk. Possessed Beast, Forgo Leon. This specimen tagged as IDF-86, left formless and floating after a humili humiliating defeat, fled to Forgo Dreams to plot their next steps, create a new army of phantom beasts, and claim Leon Gar's body as their own. When Kirby arrived to force them out, IDF-86 had no choice but to reveal their own phantom form. And there's our duplicate. All right, got a pretty good haul out of that, I think. We're up to 104 uh, figures. Considering that there are 43 figures here in the uh, wait. 
Oh, is it like you have to like upgrade them? So you have to get this the volume one figure and that unlocks the volume two figure and that unlocks the volume three figure or something? Because you got these here that are like lit up. Sort of. I don't know. Anyway. Oh, wait. Oh, it says right there, 85%. Well, we're still going to return to the tile screen just for the music, honestly. All right, so that is going to do it for today's broadcast. I want to thank you all for watching. We're going to go raid Susball, who's currently playing Death Stranding. The next scheduled stream is going to be tomorrow night at uh, 9 p.m. Or 9 p.m. I don't think we're going to start that late. 7.30 p.m. or later, Atlantic Standard Time. It is the Sunday Super Shuffle, where we're going to do some more Archipelago shenanigans. Uh, next stream after that, on Tuesday at 9 p.m. for real, Atlantic Daylight Time. It is the normal long-run stream. We're going to continue our run-through of... Wait, why did Yankee Arcade close there? There we go. Um, so yeah, uh, we're going to continue our long run of, um, ukulele. Uh, and that brings us round the week, round the wheel to our next, uh, extra long run stream where we're going to make some more progress on Kirby and Forgotten Land and hopefully at least get all of the, uh, hidden waddledees and maybe the rest of the soul pieces. All right. Let's start off this raid. Thank y'all for being here. Jewel, Tyrion, Sim Guy, Wall Link, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 0. Thank you for the follow. Um, well, yeah, thanks for hanging out. I'm cool you if you don't know. And I'll see you guys next time.